اچھا بتا کیا کر رہا ہے اچھا وین اے برڈ یوزلی ڈزن بریڈ اور اٹ ڈزن کراس پروپرلی اور یو سی دیٹ دا ایگز آر آلویز کمنگ ان فرٹائل دا یوزول پرابلم از دیٹ دا ایگ وٹ کال اٹ ٹوڈ دا بارم از دیٹ دا فیدرس کور ایوری تھنگ اپ اینڈ دا برڈ از ان ایبل ٹو کراس پروپرلی وتھ دا فیمل سو یو کین سی ایوری تھنگ واز آل کور ڈیو ٹو اٹ فیدرس سو نا ون ایوری تھنگ کپ فرام دا بارم دین ایول کراس پروپرلی This is what you should do when Bedrigas usually breed and eggs always come unfertile. One more thing which I found very beneficial in uh, breeding lovebirds is that when we have all lovebirds breeding separately, the only purpose of doing single pairing is that you should know towards the end of the season is that has your bird breeded properly or not. So let's just say for example cage number one all the way down till the bottom. I've written everything down in a register detail of every bird after every 15 days as you can see in all pages so let's just say for example we have cage number where is it gone we have cage number 80 as you can see on the 10th of december there's a line there it means it didn't breed it after 15 days it didn't breed after 15 days again it didn't breed the same way all the way till the end it neither laid the egg neither were the eggs fertile neither did any babies hatch so that means is that there's a problem with the pay so when we opened up cage number 80 then we saw towards the bottom is that that's a male and that's a male also so that's the benefit of having this charter and everything on record so i would advise all bird keepers to have the same it's very very good this way you know towards the end which pairs were good and which pairs weren't acha another thing which is important for bird breeders is that after your love bird is given one clutch and it's hatched four to five chicks and it's fed everything and what you do is that you've got to clean up the box after every clutch remove everything which is in the box and cut your your nesting which in urdu we call kuchi as you can see is that the female sitting in the box but it doesn't have much nesting okay so this is the way put the nesting out in the cage in the open and then the female and the male will come and pick up the nesting and within one day you'll see your cage line within two days you'll see is that your cage will be like that your box the love bird will come and it'll make a detailed nesting full complete and the bird will come and sit inside there so this is how you love birds prefer to breed in something which is very tight completely covered